Hello guys and welcome to Just Playing Tech. Today we're going to go over 13 thir whatever, 13 reasons why Linux is just amazing. This is it, I'm telling you now, it don't get much better than this. All right. Number 1, the package manager. Many distros have package manager. For example, I'm going to use the most popular one, probably apt or apt, advanced package tools. Using a terminal, you can literally type in sudo apt get install whatever you want. Anything. You can literally sudo apt get anything just from the terminal. Number two, you can easily switch between multiple workspaces. Say all um, your screen is filled up with a ton of windows and you want to keep what you have open, but you also need a fresh start to work on something else. Just switch workspaces. Easy. Using the terminal and other built-in tools, and because Linux is open source software, you can literally do whatever you want with your system, modify anything. You can modify anything on your system, make it to your likings, you can even, even skim it down to run it on a toaster. I mean, not likely, but you could. makes it very easy to set up a multi-boot. For example, if you want to say Windows XP and Ubuntu, no problem. The installer makes it very easy to do that. In fact, I have six operating systems on my computer. Six different Linux systems. Multi-booting works very well with the Linux installers. All right, number four, say you have a really old computer that doesn't run a bigger distro like Ubuntu or Debian very well. You can easily install a distro that's meant for small computers like Puppy Linux, for example. Puppy Linux can run on just 250 megabytes of RAM and it actually runs off RAM, so it takes it easy on your hard drive. So if you have a bad hard drive, it's good for you and it is and performance is amazing especially on older computers other distros like tiny core linux require only 46 megabytes of ram to run on and are even smaller than puppy linux All right, number six, some Linux distributions, such as Slackware, boot into the Linux kernel, which is the command line behind the graphical interface. This allows you to log in using your username and password, and then easily type in start x, start x, f, c, e, 4, start whatever, so you can easily choose which interface you would like to start and use that graphical interface or desktop environment or just use the command line if you prefer I don't
multi multitasking with, with Linux, you can easily have multiple windows open and multiple workspaces with great performance and speed, even on older, slower computers. It's amazing. Have you ever had Windows and were in need for good games distributed for free? Linux? No problem. Tons of developers out there make open source software for Linux, open source and free. So there are tons of games out there made just for Linux that are really fun to play. You can even run old games on a Linux system. Even You can even run some Windows games on an old Linux system. For example, I have... Let's see if I can show you. Need for Speed Hot Pursuit 3. Windows 98 game and I run it on my Linux PC no problem. Two, one, go! All right, another thing, Linux also has a very organized menu and interface. Unlike the boring Windows 10 UI of the super unorganized menu, Linux has a very organized menu, organized things in categories most of the time. And the usage of Linux itself is so organized and helpful most of the time. All right. Unlike Windows, Linux comes with a good software store. Most Linux distributions do, at least. As far, as far as I'm aware, every Linux distribution comes with a package manager. So you can either type in, you can either install packages from the terminal, or using, or most distros come with the Synaptic package manager or the equivalent for your package manager. Synaptic package manager is a graphical front end for apt and then some so most distros also come with a built-in software store such as the ubuntu software center or mint install which makes it very easy which a, a very useful interface easy to navigate makes it very easy and um very easy and quick to download the software you need all for free Okay. All right. Linux has low power consumption, so if you're on a laptop, your battery will last a lot longer. Great speed. It's very fast with low power consumption. Does anything you need it to do, and it doesn't over overclock or any it doesn't overpower your CPU. Most Linux distributions, especially on older computers, should only take around 5 to 10% of your CPU power to run, which means, plus your GPU, you also have the other 95 to 90% of your CPU to do whatever you need to do. And last but not least, number 13, amazing customization options. You can easily customize whatever you'd like in your Linux system and make